No one knows when the next major catastrophic event will happen or who will be hit. Floods, fire, hurricanes, earthquakes, or even malicious acts can paralyze operations of water, power, and other basic infrastructure for days or weeks. How prepared are you to protect your utility and community from disaster? How current and complete is your vulnerability assessment? The American Society of Mechanical Engineers Innovative Technology Institute and the American Water Works Association have partnered to develop a powerful critical infrastructure security standard, the Risk Analysis and Management for Critical Asset Protection, or RAMCAP, Standard for Risk and Resilience Management of Water and Wastewater Systems. Congress has made clear its intent to regulate the security of water systems, including provisions that would require frequent updates to vulnerability assessments. The all-hazards framework of the J100 RAMCAP standard captures congressional intent. You can begin to prepare your utility by implementing this important security standard. This standard provides a seven-step process for identifying, analyzing, and managing risks using an all-hazards framework that includes both malevolent attacks and natural hazards. RAMCAP implementation will help you efficiently allocate resources, identify infrastructure vulnerabilities, harden security, mitigate damage and injuries, and speed the return of service. And now, online training is available for this critical infrastructure protection tool through AWWA's e-learning program. Discover the seven vital steps to assessing the risk and resilience of your water utility. Learn the answer vital to your utility's safety. What potential man-made threats should concern me? What assets are critical to performing the primary functions of my operations? What natural hazards can strike my facility? J100 RAMCAP Standard Online Training offers a technically sound methodology to identify, analyze, quantify, and communicate the risks of terrorist attacks and natural hazards and facilitate resource allocation decisions to reduce risk and enhance resilience. Not only will you learn how to apply the security standard, you will view an in-depth case study of a model water utility in compliance with the standard. Operators and engineers may be able to obtain two continuing education units or 20 professional development hours upon successful completion of the course. Order the online training now to receive a free copy of this historic standard. Get the information you need to correctly and efficiently implement the J100 Risk Analysis and Management for Critical Asset Protection Standard for Risk and Resilience Management of Water and Wastewater Systems. Go to awwa.org forward slash J100 for more information and to register today.